see, see, I might have told you guys once before, but this my career is going to be different this time around. Yeah, I know a lot of people probably thinking, oh, I'm probably going to sign with Nike. Team Nike, right? Nah. I'm about to throw a monkey wrench right at y'all forehead. I'm about to leave y'all mind boggled out here. I'm about to sign with Jordan. I'm about to get it popping. See, the way I see it, if Jordan can have dudes out here waiting in line buying the same shoe year after year, then he got to be doing something right. I'm just saying. So, I need Jordan to make me something spectacular because I'm trying to be rich in the near future. You feel me? So, let's get into this little signature shoe creation. I'm about to I'm about to blow y'all minds. No homo. <laughs> Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Hot Pot King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. First of all, before I get this thing started, I got to give all the credit to my boy Stax Montana. I seen a little video in my subscription box. It said, how to create your own signature shoe. And I'm like, hold up, what? Huh? Hmm, hmm, where? So, you know, I decided to look it up. I was like, oh, hold on, wait, hold a minute. So, you know, as soon as I found out that I was going to be signed with Jordan, I said, yo, Stax, I need a shoe creation, man. So, he came up with this whole model right here. The only thing I added to this was laces. He actually wanted to go the zip up route where you couldn't see no laces. So, I was like, you know what, let me switch it up. I might even do it for the away sneaks. You never know. I might switch it up on them. But big shout out to Stax Montana for this, man. Hey, yo, the only bad thing about this, guys, now I know you're probably reading the title like, get your signature shoot after five games. What, huh? <laughs> what? This is the thing. You can create your own shoe, but there will not be no attribute boost. The only attribute boost that you will receive is if you wear a regular pair of Jordans or if you actually get the signature shoe endorsement within my career. But uh, it's time for me to sport these sneakers. I know y'all want to see a game, so it's time for me to go up against Kobe Bryant. I'm not afraid. Yeah. See, now I think that Eminem was the best rapper for this situation. I'm not afraid at all. I don't care who Kobe is. I'm a rookie coming into this league. I ain't got nothing to prove. Psych! I just hope that I can dunk on Kobe head. Yeah, I know that he getting old. I know he had that Achilles injury. Let's see if he got them legs back. Now, uh, you guys already know as soon as I come in the game, I gotta come in as shooting guard. It's only right, but look at me lock down Kobe. They don't even want to pass it to this guy. You got the break starter, you got the outlet pass, right the holiday. Yeah, I called for it, I'm sorry, but at least I got my assist, right? That's all that matter. Now, I don't know what this dude was doing with that floater, but trust me, the one-man fast break is real. I'm not worried about these players that they call in. I'm throwing flashy passes, me and Holiday linking up. But Kobe better step up because that jumper is cash. You best to believe it. Now, everybody already knows I play that press D. I don't care about nobody, man. If I get crossed, I get crossed as long as I don't fall. But Kobe so scared, he just got to give it up. He already know what the deal is. And look at Paul. He don't know what to do. But one move did catch me right here. This spin between the legs. I was lost. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to sit up here and, and sugarcoat it. I know what happened. I got my ankles broke. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. But trust me, the cookies is real. I don't even got to go for it. I just go for the outlet pass. A little nice dunk. Something, something light. You know what I'm saying? A little athletic windmill. I got to do my own replay. 2K be hating on me. But it's cool. We going to let it rock. <laughs> <laughs> but did you did you guys see my shoes in that in that little dunk? No, maybe I'll show you guys my shoes a little bit later. Y'all gonna get this work. That's all I'm saying. But Kobe loves to force his way, and and I I, I seriously don't know why I was sticking Nick Young, but uh, now I'll know that I need to step up in that man's face because his jumper on this game is real. It's like nothing has left from NBA 2K13 when it comes to this guy. He still nails them shots. But check me out getting with Aminu linking up. Damn, that, that felt like telepathy. Like It's like I made him float. I made the ball float. And we just synchronized at the rim. Never mind. I, I'm sorry. But Stephen Blake, I don't even know why he tried to pull in my face. I didn't believe his jumper. But the one-man fast break is still here throwing flashy passes between the legs. Did you see? Did you see that? Come on, man. I got to give y'all another replay. Look at my shoe. Look at my shoe. Uh, y'all ain't see the shoe. Y'all had to pause it. So go back. Pause. Okay. Never mind. 
I'm gonna let y'all. I'm gonna let y'all keep watching the video. But uh, we in the fourth quarter right now. I know you guys are probably like, "Yo, man, this is a short video. Why are we in the fourth already?" Because our defense is crazy. The blocks, the steals is real, but the flashy passes and the links even better. Look how I got Steve Blake all the way in the paint. He he didn't know what to do. He didn't even know it. I was shooting the jumper and he didn't even know it. That's how bad it got out there. But rule number one. Never run a full court press on me. The finger roll is real. The finger roll gets the job done. You guys thinking, oh, why don't you have posterizer? I don't need it. I got the flashy layups for y'all. But <laughs> Anthony Davis in the paint does a good job, but I got to get this one-on-one -on -one situation. This is the way to go right there, guys. When you want to get to the rim without getting the ball stripped, go to the side. You know what I'm saying? Right near the wing. Try to drive baseline. They can't stop you. But I don't know what that move is. I don't like the little flick of the wrist while you're not looking at the rim and your body's tight. I really don't like that. But, you know, we're going to let it ride because it's our points. As long as we up 20, that's all that matters. The Lakers this year, I know their ass. I'm sorry, Lakers fans, Lake Show. I don't want no beef. You know what I'm saying? Unless y'all want to leave it in the comment section. But right now, we, we, we all that. That's all I'm saying. But check me out taking Kobe to the rack. It ain't about nothing. You know what I'm saying? I got that nice little ball security. Strength, vertical, layup. Never mind. Shot in traffic. Never mind. I don't want. I don't want to talk about all of my attributes. All I'm saying is, ever since I got that blue jewelry, man, things been real easy. I don't even know why I bought it. Maybe, maybe I did want it. Maybe I wanted the bling bling a little bit. I was in my little Wayne bag at the moment. You know. No, I do not wear Jabo jeans, but it is what it is. <laughs> But I just wanted to show you guys this little nice, nice little isolation play. Show y'all that the moves is real, man. I do not play no games. Nice little backdoor cut to Anthony Davis. Y'all gonna get this replay. Oh, y'all thought it was a regular replay? Nah. We going with that Nike replay. Isn't it funny that this is supposed to be a video about Jordan, but they got Nike replays? Never mind. Back to the, back to the game. Last play. One-on-one. -on -one. Me and Nash, young versus old. It's about to go down. Yeah, I took him to the rim. No, no, I get my own rebound. Don't worry. Put him in the post. Get the end one. Excuse me. I'm going to the rack. You know what I'm saying? Something, something light, something light. You know, when, hey, I could have had an A plus this game. I decided to go with the A. Okay, that's backwards. I decided to go with the A because I had a lot of turnovers. Yeah, I'm going to admit it, man. I'm going to admit it. These turnovers are real. It's crazy out here on this court. But I'm about to shoot this nice little free throw, get this game over with. 28 and 12. Yeah. I'm 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 working in the future on y'all. I nailed it. So 28 and 12 is what I ended with. It was a great game. It was a breakout game. And I feel like these Jordans on my feet. Is it the shoes? Is it the shoes? I don't I don't know. It I mean, ever since I put these Jordans on my feet, things are things are going great for me Kobe is going to the locker room he's not shaking any hands he's not giving anybody his armband he doesn't want to you know talk to any reporters come on Kobe show some sportsmanship right bro I'm just I'm just saying you know it, it'll be great if you you know come out here we shake hands I say I bust your ass that game no homo but let's get into the player of the game y'all this beat is by my boy kill confirm
Tonight, for the first time, you cracked double digits in assists. Did you see this coming before the game, or did it end up being a bit of a surprise? I wouldn't say I expected it. I mean, I felt pretty good going in, and then as the game got going, things just kept clicking. I was finding my teammates at the right times, and they were knocking down their shots. Really, my part was the easy part. I just passed the ball where it made sense, and the rest worked itself out. Hey, y'all. Thanks for watching. Make sure you leave a like on this video. This is IKC signing out. Peace. This is Siri. Thank you for watching, and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.